Well, hello there, do hope you're all well. Now, as we showed in earlier video, our, if our Alexander Boris de Peffel Johnson wasn't getting his ass handed to him by Keir Starmer for making life uncomfortable for him, then it was Ian Blackford. And if it wasn't Ian Blackford, it was Lindsay Hoyle basically growing some balls and getting him told in no certain terms that I'm sorry to say, Bodger Johnson, this is not uh, leader of the op opposition Q&As. So, so, so it was good to see that because I'd had enough of listening to his nonsense. But if it weren't any of them, it was himself making a complete and utter ass of himself and uh, showing that how uh, immature he is with his misconduct quote but not to be outdone the conservative MP for Litchfield Michael Wiggy Fabricant clutched his pearls didn't he he went oh, Kiss time I called him a coward oh, how dare he oh, I've gone all oh, I've gone all a quiver let's have a listen to this nonsense I've just received on the wires that the leader of the opposition, and I didn't hear this at the time because of so much noise, called the Prime Minister a coward. Surely that is in breach of Erskine May and improper and should be withdrawn. Can I say there was a lot of language that I couldn't hear today, and I certainly don't want words. Coward is not what is used in this house, and I'm sure that the leader of the opposition would withdraw. withdraw. I withdraw it, but he's no leader. Yeah. Well, you see, stay at that wig. You can tell what happened when it were all kicking off and uh, Bodge is getting a paste in and, and making himself look like an absolute disgrace. Clearly, he let his emotions get the better of himself and his wig fell off and he's just picked on him. Just plonked it, looked like uh, a ferret had just landed on his head <sighs> Jesus Christ <laughs> this this is the same guy in I think about it 2017 when they probably if I remember rightly they had a, a conservative conference up in Manchester if I remember rightly and you know people were protesting you know are not happy with this government you know with Tory austerity and having to live on poverty wages and going to food banks to just to get through through the day and survive or whatever and this is a guy who tweeted calling them fascists so let's be honest you know stranger to the insults michael fabricant so let's stop the absolute pearl clutching and uh the <gasps> because you just you, you know different yourself you're just an absolute disgusting vile human being just like our bodges what do you guys think right i shall leave the video here until the next time i shall bid you farewell take care